The president has called for national solidarity. Absolutely. And we've already can see this morning that the French flag, the tricolour, is being flown with pride. You think the French are very nationalistic people. In fact, they aren't. And yet today they are bringing out their flags, 500 percent increase in the sale of them. Uh, it's to show pride and to show solidarity. Well, I'm joined this morning by Charlotte Brejo, who, um, to put it bluntly, Charlotte, you were at the Cambodian restaurant on Friday the 13th. Yeah. And you held onto a woman who eventually died from gunshot wounds. There's no other way of putting it. Uh, and I'm sorry that you had to go through that. And I know you don't necessarily want to go through that again because you've been doing it for the last two weeks. But just tell me, you're going to the memorial service today at the Les Invalides behind us. What does it mean to you today? Um, well, it's incredibly important to, for me, for everybody here, to honour the lives of the people who were there. And that's, I think that's really something that we can't lose sight of is the fact that innocent people lost their lives and um, I'm everybody lost something didn't they that day yeah it, 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 uh, there was something else that's like I felt it what do you feel here I feel that like? I, I mean I was incredibly fortunate I didn't I didn't lose anyone I loved and I didn't lose my own life but definitely lost a, a sense of security and a sense of a sense of meaning mm. um, and I feel that people are trying to get back to normal and, and French, the French people are being defiant in the face of what's happened but ultimately it's it, it's never going to be the same again and it's maybe it's a good thing that we recognize that you know there was something evil happened and that it's important to to have some understanding that you know life has value and our and the things that we stand for remain important to and us. A moment of togetherness for everyone who is affected today.